Hey, beauty, it's Curly Kimister, and I'm here today to introduce to you a brand new product from my favorite natural hair, black owned natural hair beauty store, Horizon Beauty. And if you want to know what I think about this new product, this is their brand new gel. Brand new gel, I've tested it. I've been posting about it. If you're not following me on Snapchat, you need to. You miss all the latest updates. Um, yeah, if you want to know what I think about this brand new gel, this brand new gel, you want to know what I think about it? Brand new natural gel. Please stay tuned. Okay, so like I was saying in the intro, this product, it's a gel. It's from Horizon Beauty. They're, they have a, their own beauty store in North Carolina, in Durham, North Carolina. But if you're not in Durham, North Carolina, you can visit them online, horizonbeauty.com. And they have this brand new, they have a beauty bar. And at the beauty bar, you can get custom body wash, conditioners. Um, I think you can get like a rinse out conditioner, like for your hair too. They have really nice products. You can like customize, put your favorite oils and scents in them. And they also have You Go Curl, and it's a curl enhancing gel. Yep. They did give me this product the last time I was in Durham for the holidays. However, they did, nobody paid me for this review. Nobody paid me. This is my own honest opinion. And I'm very excited to bring this to you. And part of it is I love supporting black owned female businesses. Love that. It's one of my favorite things to do. Love supporting small businesses, female owned businesses. Love that. Love that. Love that so much. So I'm so super excited for them um, with this product. So um, here are the ingredients. It's called What's in here is aloe vera, distilled water, horsetail, nettle, chamomile, marshmallow root, citric acid, vitamin E, grapeseed oil, and black seed oil. And right now there's no scent in here. I don't know if they're gonna add a scent or not, but it, this is, in this form, is unscented. Now, one of the good things about this product, before I'll get into how I feel about it, it's $19.99. Really, really good price point for an all natural gel. Okay, $19.99. Mm-hmm. So here, let me tell you what I think about it. I don't need to smell it, it's unscented. It doesn't have a scent. So there you go. So this won't bother anybody. If you're somebody who has an issue with fragrances or fragrances bother you, this would be great for you. Or you're allergic to fragrances. Great, unscented. So um, this product, as I'm showing you the consistency on your screen right now, this product is a gel. And it's not a clear gel, it's a little bit opaque it's got a little color to it um, but it's snotty you see it, it actually is a snotty gel so it is going to clump some things together kind of snotty and that's what we like with a gel we want it to be a little snotty it sounds kind of gross but we need it to be snotty in order to clump our curls right y'all know y'all know okay so um this gel is really good this is a an amazing gel amazing Amazing. It's in my hair right now. Did my hair last night. So this is first day hair. I consider it first day because I, I always do my hair in the evening. So the first full day is today. Um, but if you look, I got definition all up in here. Definition over here. In fact, I don't even think I have any frizz at this point. So when I do, you can always tell when you do your hair, uh, when you first distribute the gel, like are you starting to see frizz when it's wet? Then you know what's gonna happen when it dries. This one, when you apply it, it stays frizz free. Here you go. I mean, these are the results. I'm sorry. I've used this gel four times and I've got this much left. And I was like, I need to do a review now because I'll probably get one more use out of it and then I won't be able to show you the product. So I was like, let me go ahead and do a review. Um, I've had no issues with this gel as far as um, using it with another, with a leave-in. It doesn't flake. There's no snow floating around of particles flying. None of that. Um, and I used it with three different leave-ins. I used it with um, Smooth Naturals Moisture Milk, Perfect Moisture Milk. I've used it with... Um, it was a sample that I had, and I can't remember what it was called. Coconut something. I don't know. I can't think of it. I'm drawing a blank. So I had one sample that I used it with, and I used it with another Smooth Naturals product, the Buttercream. Um, I think it was just those three, if I'm remembering correctly. Um, but yeah, no issues, flaky, nothing. So it, it works well with other le or with it worked well with the leave-ins that I used it with. And um, yeah, it just, I apply it onto my hair. My hair is nice. And you can see actually the video that I'm showing you um, of the first day that I used, the very first time that I used it, my hair looked really nice after applying it. Totally 
Compte Curls definition, no frizz. Now, you know, for me, I get frizz. I work out five days a week. So, you know, working out, you get frizz. I do a lot of working out outside, walking, sometimes running outside. So air creates frizz, especially moving as fast as I move. So some of the frizz that I know that I'm going to get is unavoidable. That's just the reality of whatever gel I'm using now that I work out so much. Um, but I'm able to get with this gel three days worth of hair that I'm comfortable with wearing before I'm going to either put it up or put it in a headband or like do my little favorite super quick hairstyle, which I'll leave that up there. You can check on it if you want, but it was like ridiculous. It was the fastest hairdo ever. Um, but it's the number one thing I love to do when my hair is starting to look frizzy. So anyway, so I will do that or whatever if it starts to look crazy. Or, you know, I do my hair twice a week, so it's usually time for me to do it. So I really only need a gel to last me three days, three days worth of hold. I got three days with this. Um, yeah. So like I said, um, I'm really excited, really excited for them. This is a great gel. I really think anybody should check it out. Um, it did give me a little bit of crunch. In fact, it's a little bit now, but not much at all. Like at the end of the first time I used it, I noticed it more. And part of it was I was a little bit heavy handed. I was like putting so much on. Um, and at the end of the day, it was basically gone. So I didn't even have to crunch it out, crunch. And I don't really mind a little bit of crunch because I know that means it's gonna hold my hair together longer. So it doesn't really bother me. And it wasn't one of those crunchies where it's like hard and stiff and like cracking. It wasn't like that. It was, you know, a little bit of crunch, but not a lot. And at the end of the first day, it was gone. And this is about um, midday and it's basically gone. Um, but I've also, I don't use as much as I did the first time. So maybe that had something to do with it. I don't know. But yeah, so that's, I guess it's kind of a con. Um, not really for me personally, because I expect I'm going to get that from a gel, particularly if a gel is going to hold my hair for a few days. So yeah, that's kind of a tiny one, but anyway, whatever. Um, so just if you want hair that doesn't have any crunch at all, this won't be the gel for you. But I really think that in order to have some type of hold over a long period of time, you gotta have even just a little bit of crunch, which mainly just means it's holding your curls together and hopefully helping to prevent frizz over time. And usually it just works its way out in a day or two. Your hair, it gets in the air. And it helps if you use a butter. I always use butters when I um, wash my hair, so that helps to alleviate some. And I used a good amount yesterday, so maybe that's why I'm feeling almost no crunch today. Like, it's basically gone. Um, the little bit that I felt earlier this morning. So yeah, but enough about that. I think everybody should try this gel. I really do. This is a really good gel. Um, my hair is kinky. Um, if you have kinky hair or curly hair or hair that has, you know, any bit of frizz potential at all, I highly recommend that you try this gel. Ingredients are really good. It goes on super easy. I had no issue applying it. It's got a nice slip and great consistency. Um, yeah really excited. So in order to get this, if you are in North Carolina, you can go right to Northgate Mall. And if you're in Durham, you can go right to Northgate Mall to their shop, Horizon Beauty, and you can get it in person and tell them I sent you. And it's a great price for $19.99, y'all. Great price. Um, and if you are not in North Carolina, or like me, I'm not, I'm in LA, you can, or at least once a year I'm in North Carolina, but normally I'm in LA, you can go online and order it, horizonbeauty.com, and you can order it and they will send it to you. Yeah, definitely recommend you check it out. This is really, I mean, seriously, this is a really good gel. This is has HG potential for me. It does. This gel reacts similarly to some of my other favorites. I don't like to compare products um, compare brands on reviews. I really don't. I think it's fair to focus on the brand that I'm reviewing and I don't like to bring up other names. I just don't think that's fair. Um, but some of the other brands that I really like, it reacts similarly. I will say that. So yeah, it has HD potential for me. So, but I've only used it four times. We'll see how it reacts over several months, but I don't think it's going to be any different, really. Usually I can tell right away with a gel. It's just one of those things. Some products, it takes a minute to see. I can tell whether or not I'm going to like a gel when I first apply. If I apply a gel and it makes my hair frizzy the first day, it's not going to get any better. <laughs> but if I apply it and it works great for me the first time I use it, then I want to see if it's going to continue to do it over time. But it's not, if it starts out bad, it's not getting better. Basically, that makes sense. 
<laughs> anyway, go to their website, check them out. If you happen to chat with them, tell them I sent you that you saw my video. I would love for them to know that uh, my video is out there and that they and how much I really, really am enjoying this product so, so much. So. I'm gonna stop talking. If you happen to have tried this gel, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about it. I know you are loving it if you've tried it. If you have any questions about it or about any of their other products, they have the whole natural hair store. Um, so on their website, there are other brands and other really nice brands too that you can check out. Um, in addition to this really great gel that I love. Oh my gosh, I'm totally forgetting this whole thing. Um, uh, let me just back up this whole review. <laughs> Um, the thing that they do recommend that you use with this gel is their aloe water. And um, I'm not really sure what this is supposed to do. I don't know if it's, it helps to pH balance your hair before you put on the gel. Um, but I use this three of the times, three of the four times that I use it, I use this first. After I rinse out my conditioner, my hair is in sections, then I spritz, spritz this into each section, then I put on my leave-in, and then my butter. That's pretty much how I used it. Um, and. I'm gonna have to test this out a few more times to see whether or not um, this is something that I can recommend, um, or whether or not I see a difference with other gels, but I did notice a little bit of a difference because I used this gel one time without it, and I noticed that I had a little bit more frizz, just a little bit, not even enough to really, I'm like, it could just be a coincidence that, that particular way I applied it or something, or maybe maybe I worked out that day and it was a little frizz. I don't know what it was, but, um, the times that I've used this, these together, they work really well together. That's all I'm gonna say. Um, but like I said, I am going to, eat, but when I didn't use it, I still had, still had good results with this. So, but what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a separate review of this, <laughs> and I'm gonna try it with other gels that I have to see if I see a difference before with it, without it, I don't know. But these two together do work really well. But this on its own works really well too. So I'll just sit that right there. So oh, that's it. I'm really done now. So I guess that's it. I will catch you guys on the next video. Bye. Hey beauty, this is Curly Kimmy Star and I'm here today to do a product review. And what I'm reviewing today is the brand new, just came out this month, Makeup Forever Ultra HD Concealer. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to share this with you guys. If you wanna hear all about this brand new concealer and see what I think about it and actually get to see all the different shades that they've come out with. And also I'm gonna do a demo to show you how I apply my concealer and you'll get to see how this works. So please, if you're interested and you wanna check all that out, please stay tuned.